the back rooms. You've been here before. Object number 90, light wires. Input key, yes or no? Yes. Parsing key, access granted. Open object 90 document. Object number 90, light wires. Description. Light wires are types of cables found within the back rooms. They have various functional capabilities through transmitting or receiving electromagnetic wavelengths of light. Translucent wires. Translucent wires are a type of flexible fiber optic cable found attached to walls and ceilings. They function by sending information via impulses of infrared light with specific temporal intervals. Dissimilar to normal optic fibers, any light passed through will internally reflect independently at any given angle. These wires each have a radius of 1 cm, tilde 0.3 inches, and can transmit data between two points in an instant. Unusually, some cables have been reported to connect to other levels within the back rooms, as some conveyed information from these wires can be received across different levels. Image Caption Translucent Wires Receiving Data from Light These wires are usually connected to technological devices that can be used to transfer directives and messages to local computers by creating an algorithm. The likelihood of the wire being attached to two separate computers is remote, but possible in a few circumstances. Data can still be successfully dispatched during online instances and can travel over prolonged distances. Due to their advantageous properties, translucent wires are frequently used for offline communication. However, receiving responses from other wanderers is unusual because of their high disparity. It is crucial to maintain certain protocols, as astute entities have often been reported being able to use digital systems connected to these wires. Blue Wires Image Caption Blue light coming from the wire theorized to be a cause of Chernikov radiation. Unlike translucent cables, blue wires cannot transmit any data. Rather, they output light systematically. The wire consists of an attuned pliable glass cable encased within a thick insulator, often theorized to be plastic, as a consequence of their similar flexibility and longevity. Blue wires are often mistaken to be translucent wires due to their similar appearances. Despite this, one must never approach the cable's aperture within 3 meters, 9.1 feet, distance. Blue wires have often been witnessed emitting a concentrated beam with a mixture of violet and blue light, as they produce an unprecedented amount of radiation. It has been compared to the amount of damage inflicted by a gamma ray burst, but in a confined area. However, exposure to beams emitted from blue wires has been shown to cause minimal side effects due to radiation causing total destruction of genetic code, killing all susceptible cells within a macroscopic area. These cables are often seen to maintain full functionality subsequent to being cut. However, they are frequently witnessed to malfunction after an uncertain amount of time. The purpose of its existence and utilization is unknown. However, it is deemed to be an acceptable tool for eliminating perilous skin infections and certain pathogenic entities. Footnote, it is recommended to utilize this during critical or severe situations. End footnote. Sources of radiation are theorized to be a cause of an abundance of different radioisotopes. However, this cannot be determined currently. Warped wires. Warped wires act similarly to virtual particles. Footnote. Virtual particles are quantum particles that pop into existence temporarily. End footnote. And are rarely seen within the back rooms. They are often reported to vanish within seconds of contact, then reappear in a different and random location within a level. Due to the total extended perimeter of the cable, there are questions about whether it should be classified as a type of light cable. 
These wires contort the space around them, causing visual distortions to everything surrounding their perimeter. If distance is not properly maintained, one can be pulled into the opening of the tube due to high suction force caused by unknown factors. Currently, it cannot be determined what warped wires are. They are often thought of as a type of transient transportation device between spatial dimensions due to their identical features with wormholes. This hypothesis is conventional and is theorized to be true to an extent. Due to the permanent cessation of communication following suction into the wires, the tangible location present on the other side is ambiguous. While translucent wires have been used to try and prolong a contact duration, they seem to be repelled by a metaphysical force when in close proximity. Electromagnetism is widely thought to be the cause of this repulsion, thus leading to the belief that all light wires contain some assortment of electrical current. As a result, there have been many unique and diverse ideas about how to utilize these wires. Experimentation Log An experiment was conducted to witness the behavior of warped wires when coming in contact with the radioactive light from blue wires. The conclusion has confirmed the existence of a potential higher dimensional space beyond the warped cables. This indicates that these transitory wires are intrinsically related to wormholes, capable of creating shortcuts to inaccessible spatial regions. Experimentation Report Subject Object 90 Blue Wires and Warped Wires Procedure Two individuals in charge of the study were assigned to explore the unending, segmented rooms of Level 1 until finding an instance of a warped wire. Prior to the main event, a sample of blue wires had been retrieved by MEG Regiment personnel, which ultimately became the primary tool for this experiment. An instance of warped wires was discovered after four to five hours of heavy exploring. The two members followed the usual safety protocols by keeping a 15-meter distance away from the aperture of the warped cable. The light was quickly shined into the opening. Results After seconds of contact, a small, distinctive holographic image was displayed, presumably depicting the other point in space-time of the warped wire. A closer examination of the image using cheap binoculars revealed a restricted space resembling a set of liminal spaces, each different from one another, theorized to be the collection of all the backrooms levels. Both members later proclaimed to have sighted the blue channel being a subset of the spatial dimension they witnessed, potentially indicating that warped wires are subtly linked with a higher dimension that transcends the fourth. Footnote Currently, there is no confirmation of what dimension this tangible or intangible location dwells in. End footnote. Any objects that have fallen into the abyss have documented to dematerialize and vanish. However, it is often thought to be the cause of them entering a dimensional axis that cannot be viewed from the third dimension. In order to ensure safety, no wanderers should be allowed to enter these cables until further public information becomes available. Analysis It is unknown how the interaction between the two wires caused the projected images, but they are thought to be the cause of the wavelengths desynchronizing after reflecting off of the warped wires, making the light more dispersed. Additionally, repellent forces experienced when these cables are close to one another is hypothesized to play an important role. However, this has yet to be determined.